Reban soto komo se tele, man toto bo se ba, robo so komande bebo, robo komo se te, ba se ke mando. For the Lord says, son, I've seen your faithfulness, even in times of weariness, even at times when older people in the gospel looked at you and, and mocked because of your youthfulness and your age. And even as you spoke of doing big things that they said, I'll wait and just kind of see how, how it happens. You know, I'll just watch and kind of see if, if he's going to fail. But the Lord says that I've proved you and I'm proving you and I'm bringing of increase. Not only to your ministry in the natural and to the helpers and to the financial support that's going to flow in from America and flow in from Europe and flow in even from other African nations. The Lord says, as a sign unto you, I would even cause financial support to come to you from even poorer nations that are even less privileged than Kenya. There will be a sign to you that is my hand and my call and my grace and my anointing and my favor. And the Lord says over you both, I've seen your sincerity to pe for people. I've seen your heart for souls. And the Lord says, man of God, in this season, I'm increasing uh, your heartbeat in the spirit. I'm increasing your speed in the spirit. I'll cause you to do more with less. And I'll cause you to do double with more. And I'll cause you to do even sometimes the miraculous with nothing. <laughs> but the Lord says, I laugh over those in the spirit that will try to come against you. For you've humbled yourself. And the Lord says that those that will humble themselves before me, I will give grace to them. The Lord says he sees you this day. And the Lord also says that there's an apostolic call upon your life. That he's going to begin to reveal more and more. For he's even called you as a father in the spirit. To raise up pastors. To raise up leaders. To raise up ministers. And yes, you go by Pastor Maurice. But many are going to identify you as an apostolic figure. An apostolic father. The Lord says, son, you did not seek a position. You did not seek a title. You did not seek fame. You did not seek rec recognition. But you sought me. And so I'm honoring you to this day, day, says the Lord. Woman of God, the Lord says, I'm putting a new fire in your belly. I'm putting a new anointing upon you. Even as you've been seated, the Lord says, I'm stirring up something in you. Where there's going to be times you're going to want to just jump up and grab the mic. And I'm going to put a fresh word in your mouth. It's going to be a word that you did not plan out. For it's going to be a word of fire. It's going to be a prophetic word. But the Lord says, even gifts of evangelism and gifts of the prophetic. I begin to flow in you in new capacities and new measures. Even dreams and visions will flow. And even now as the wind is blowing, the Lord sent an angelic reinforcements. The Lord's even reassigning angels to your life and to your mantle and to your ministry in the name of Jesus Christ. Lift your hands and praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah.